Hi everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome if you're new here. Any hoosies. Today I got this palette in the mail. So I got this one in the mail today. I'm super stoked. Here's the color story. This is Nightshade by Gourmand Girls. Mm, I'm super excited to play with this. I literally got it in the mail today. Um, I did kind of swatch some of the shades, like just, just to be curious, but I have not swatched them on camera. But we're going to play with them today. And I'm thinking, I'm thinking yellow and purple. What's your opinion? Yay? I know, right? So I think we're going to do yellow and purple. So grab your brushes, grab your palettes. Let's get into it. Okay, for the eye primer, I am using Gerard Cosmetics. I'm using the white base because we're going yellow. So I really, really want the eyeshadow to pop. And I have found that if you really want an eyeshadow to really like pop or like, you know, really to come across, I guess pop is a word, I guess is what I want to use. Um, use a white base. And I like Gerard Cosmetics base, especially the white one. Well, I like all of them, but I like these because they're easy to blend. Plus you can set them with powder if you want to. You don't have to, at least I don't have to on my skin, but you can if you want to. I am not going to set them today. Um, they do dry down, but I really like them. I find that with my 45 year old eyes, I know, right? That if they do settle, it's easier to buff them out. So like buff out the, the, the crease, I guess I should say. Anyway, the lighting is different because I'm kind of playing with my lighting. I got a new camera, so I'm not sure about my camera. I'm not sure about my lighting with this new camera. So I don't know. Listen, girl, I'm just not techie. I'm not a techie person. Technology does not like me. I don't, I don't like technology either. So since we've, you know, got that understanding going on, I'm just trying to meet on some middle ground here. I just need the camera to just like Dr. Seuss level it down. Word, like, be nice to me. Ish. Any hoosies. We're going to uh, put my hair back. This video I think is going to be super short and super easy because I don't think it's going to take very long because I'm only using like three, four colors. And I think I, well, we all know I start the video out with an idea in my head and it never ends up that way. So who knows if this is going to end up that way today. Any hoosies. I will pop up next to me what colors I'm using. But I think I'm going to go into, I think I'm going to go into Woody and I'm going to go on the outer corner and I'm going to try to really pack this on and just know that since we used this white base, that these colors are really, really going to pop. I'm hoping that I'm not going to have to do much blending. Now, I will tell you from experience speaking and being older and having hooded eyes, I will tell you that sometimes like when you put down the white base out here, like if you don't have like the eyeshadow overlapping the white base or the white base coming into, you know, like some sort of blend out here, you have a harsh line between your foundation and that white base. It, it looks, it kind of looks weird. So just, just a heads up. So if you ever use a white base and you're like, why does it look so weird out there? It, that's, that's probably why, um, experience speaking. Cause it took me like a hot minute to figure that out. So being older and, but yes, I, I like, I like using the white bases if I really want my eyeshadow to, to really be seen. And we all know that Gourmand Girls is an indie brand and their formula is 
freaking amazing. So I am super excited to try this yellow. Um, I know yellow and purple, sometimes their shades are hard to make, let alone hard to blend, hard to wear because they wear off easy. So I am, I am curious to know how all this is going to go down, but I, I am in it. Girl, we are in it. We are, we don't even have a toe in it now. We are in it head first. So here we come. So the next, I think the next color I'm going to go into, we're going to go into bittersweet, which is now that yellow. I'm super excited. So yes, ooh, yes, I'm tapping off, but I'm trying to still pack on the color at the same time. And the reason why is because I like, because I have hooded eyes and I have wrinkles. I want to try to blend this all at the same time. And I know I say that every time. It's like, girl, you say that every time. I know I say that every time. But I think this time I can pull it off. I think this time I can actually pull this off. So I'm just packing this on so I can blend, 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 blend as I pack. And just know that everybody's different. So it doesn't matter what color goes with what. I feel that any color goes with any color. Like makeup is just makeup. You can wash it off at the end of the day. I've said that 60,000 times. So you all know that. So if you think that uh, those two colors don't match, um, maybe not to you. But girl, if you want to wear those two colors, you wear those two colors. If you want to wear those 10 colors, you wear those 10 colors. Just, you do you, girl. It washes off at the end of the day. Any hoosies, next color, flowering. We're going to go in with flowering, and I'm going to go in with my finger. Look at that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Any hoosies. Oh, yes. Yes, ma'am. Anyway, I turned my lights down some because I think it's easier for you guys to see also on camera the, the makeup that I'm putting on as well. So the lights aren't just like in my face and your face. I mean, it's very dark in here to me, but it's not on camera. So other than behind me, but filming is weird, you guys. It's, it's weird. It's, like I said, technology hates me, but I'm trying, I'm trying. You guys, I really like that. Mm-hmm. Yep. Sure deal. Okay, I think we're going to go in the inner corner. Ooh, I think we're going to go in the inner corner with Dream Shade. Mm-hmm. Let me see what this does. Oh, yes. Oh my gosh. Y'all. I am really glad that what I have in my head is coming out on my eyeballs. Very seldom does this ever work. But yes. Oh my goodness. Like, I, I, I just want to keep adding. Like, it just, it's just so good. Of course, I will link this palette uh, below. I will link the primer below. Holy cow. Y'all. Hmm. Huh. Okay, so before I do the top, I think underneath, underneath my lash line on the lower lashes. I think I'm going to go out on the outer corner with Woody. And I don't know where this black is coming from, but we're going to get rid of that. There we go. So yeah, with Woody. Yeah, that's coming together. Just, just fine. Just fine. Okay, and then I think on the inner corner, 
on the lower lash line. I think I want to go into, I think I want to go into Nightshade, which is the lighter purple right here, just to see. I see a little bit of difference. Like I see it on my end. I hope you guys can see it on yours. Oh my gosh. I just can't get over that yellow. Okay. I know I said I hope I blend, blend, blend. Okay. I think since we did Woody on the outer, I think I'm going to go in this line right here. I think I'm going to go in with nightshade just a tad bit. Just a tad bit. Like I, I, not much. Like I don't want to. I don't want to disrupt it. Yes, that that made a difference to me. Does it to you? I mean, it just to blend some of that. Just to. Oh my gosh, you guys! That yellow. I'm so excited. Yay. Okay, so I think I think underneath the brow. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, I think we're gonna go in with enchanter which is this white shade I don't oh oh that's like all of the shades mixed do you see that I don't know dude I mean see it on this eye holy mackerel I think that's like it's like white in the pan but like it goes on the eye as if, whoa. Y'all, I'm digging it. I like it. Let me finish the look. Hold on to your butts. I'll be right back. Okay, y'all. Here's the finished look. Oh my gosh, I love the yellow. And I love the purple. And I love the shine. So I'm going to go about my day. I hope you guys are having an awesome, amazing day. Uh, go out and do something kind for somebody. And I will see you in my next video.